in his office. Except he ain't in the community. And he ain't even at home. <laughs> we got a problem, y'all. Hell Snow, Tom Perry has got to go. And how they beat that man. And how they threw a bag over his face. And he died. We got a problem. We got a problem. We got a serious problem in the city of Milwaukee, and we got a mayor who's not addressing these problems. We have a team who's not holding his police officers accountable when they break the law. We have a fire police commission who's supposed to uphold equal application of the law. And they let him get away with crimes. We got a problem. Hey, Who do you right. call when the city breaks the law? That's right. That's right. Who do you call when the police break the law? That's right. Yeah. Who do you call when the mayor breaks the law? That's right. That's right. You call right. on the people. That's right. When the hood right. wake up. When the hood wake up. We're going to shut down. When the hood wake up. We're going to shut down. When the hood wake up. We're going to shut down. We need the Declaration of Independence. In these states, any time when the government becomes corrupt, any time when the government no longer upholds the responsibilities of the law, it is the job of the people to either alter or to abolish it all together. We went down Thursday. We went down to address an issue. We went down to talk about justice. We went down there in peace and love. Yes. The, the people want to call yeah. us. See, we're standing at a house as a symbol. Mayor Barry's house is a symbol. It's a symbol of, of, of what it's supposed to be. We pay him for this house, our tax money. What you got to understand is when they don't address the serious issues in our community, we're going to affect theirs. And the people who are in this community, they sleep in peace. But the people in our neighborhoods, they sleep in fear. When it comes to black male unemployment, and these are black men who are eligible to work, we have been second in the nation since 2009. But they call us lazy. And they, that's right. We also are the fifth poor city in the United States of America. We have a problem. Right now we got a fire police commission board who only three members serve in the discipline action uh, committee. When you look at this committee, any time when an officer breaks the law, he only has to be held accountable to three people on the board. That's we the want the same right opportunity to sleep in peace. We want the same opportunity for our children to go to school. We want the same opportunity for our women to be respected. When you hit a woman in the face, and get paid for it. And get back paid for it. What kind of message do that say? No justice, no peace. No justice, no peace. No justice, no peace. Our streets. Our streets. Yeah, please. Anytime you have an elected official who everybody probably voted for. Right. And turns his back on the people who voted for him, we are living in hell. Anytime a human being is left in back of a squad car of our police department and is left there to die, we are living in hell. We're living in hell. Yeah, right in front of this house. Yes, yes. And that's Tom Barrett. Now we understand that this is not just switched from Chief Flynn to Tom Barrett. That's right, no. that's right. We haven't taken our focus off of Chief Flynn. That's right. right, right Chief right. Flynn is a quilt. He got to go. He got to He's go. He's not off the hook. That's right. Right. But see, when when our mayor, our beloved superstar of a mayor, mm. appointed Chief Flynn yep. and stands by his wrong and his corruptness, that's right. right. Then we have to hold the one we put in office to. Oh, that's oh, right. Oh, oh, oh.
abolish the mob, it'll take you back to slavery. And it's called lynching. You know it just as well as we oh, all man. know. That John Spooner and Bob Donovan needs to be held accountable for the murder of Derry. Because if it was in my neighborhood, and if I met with somebody before they went to go kill somebody else, and if I knew about it, and if I didn't say nothing, I would get charged with the same crime as my brother. For so long. And it's time for the people to stand up because we can't depend on the very same people who's supposed to protect and serve. We can't depend on the very same people who's supposed to come in office and uphold the rights of the They afraid of young black men, of young black women, of a group that can come together with allies, white, black, green, yellow, blue. They're afraid of that. Ain't no like the power of the people because the power of the people don't stop.